Thanks, Megan, and good morning to Long. We're at Avalon Raceway, and we've got a sneak preview of some sprint car racing with the SRA guys, guys like Vogels, Amato, and Co. It's getting a little noisy here, so we're going to send you straight into some of the racing. We'll catch up with you soon. Thanks. The four white salute to you, the fans. And again, you've done us proud. Well, we are going green very quickly. Loud may have caught them napping. Thundering down the back, shooting to turn number three. Anderson to second. Reed quickly to third. Rankin back to fourth. Molino in fifth. And it's Milburn. Van Bremen. Monster wheel stand turning into a wild series of barrel rolls for Rod Matthews. Right in front of turn number two. A wicked ride for Rod Matthews in the Victoria 9. Lights are out. 29 of 30 laps remain on the board. We're underway. Loudon picks up the pace. Front wheels dancing in the air on the west side. Honda number 92. And he maintains that down the back chute. Well, it's an exciting sport for that reason. Matthew Reed hooked up. Currently third, looking for some room, but he needs some traffic. Losing a little ground to first and second. Yellow lights on. We've got Ron Dalton and Harley Bishop coming together. Fairly minor skirmish. Yellow lights on. The pair may have come together in turn number two. Didn't look like too much in it. Stokesy, did you see the incident? Just catch the end of it there, Gav. Not a lot into it, as you can see. A little skirmish, as you call it between Bishop and... Has anyone got anything for the Sydney Sider? We're about to find out. Oh, Milburn misses the spot in turn one, allows Van Bremen to sneak through to sixth. MVB, ever alert, grabs a position. Eddie Lumber does likewise, deep in the field on Domain Ramsey. Loud. Rockets down the main straight. 26 to go. Anderson, Reed, Tim Rankin in fourth, Molino in fifth. Van Bremen back to Milburn. Carl Ludeman, great run for Ludo. Simon Amato transferred through the B main. Eddie Lumber back to the main Ramsey. Glenn Sutherland a little further back to Charles Hunter. Harley Bishop, Ronnie Dalton, and then your race leader. Loudon right on the tail of Ron Dalton, looking to go to the outside in turn three, and he does. Amato has a minor excursion to the infield of the main chute. He remains on track as the yellow lights come on. Anderson, and third place, Matthew Reed. Well, Darren Molino had a nice little peek on the inside of Matthew Reed, but it all accounts to zip as MVB rockets through on Molino. Milburn following suit. Well, fourth to sixth in the blink of an eye for Darren Molino. As we've got one going around in turn four, that's Simon Amato. He comes infield. May call it a day. He'd only just moments before been sent to the rear of field and he's out of this one. Domain Ramsey infield as well. So there's several dropping out with 21 to go. Loudon continues to pace the field. Anderson, Reed, back to MVB in fourth. Then it's Milburn in fifth. Molino, Carl Ludeman, Eddie Lumber. What a performance from Fast Eddie. Back to Charles Hunter, Sutherland, Harley Bishop, Ron Dalton, and then your race leader. Smooth as silk around the high side of Ron Dalton. Loudon looking to extend the gap over Grant Anderson. Matthew Reed still looking for an opportunity to reel in the top two. Harley Bishop next in the sight to be a leader, Ian Loudon. 17 laps remain. He looks so smooth, so comfortable. He's got near on the back stretch advantage over second place. Almost the same advantage for Anderson over Reed in third. Fourth place, Van Bremen. He's about half the back straightaway off third place, Reed. 
Just to give you a heads up there on Van Bremen. Gavin, just from our angle up here, he's really entering corners one and two. Very shallow. He's happy to stay down there. We talked about that rut that may be halfway up in the corner. He is trying to avoid that every time. Lap car between your leader Loudon and second place Anderson. That being Glenn Sutherland. 13 to go this time by. It's all smooth sailing. Track starting to widen out somewhat for Loudon. Anderson through on Sutherland. Still, he's in touch with your race leader. And it's not done and dusted. There's four lap cars right ahead of him. Anderson closing. This is the closest he's been since the restart. Reed handily placed in third. Van Bremen closing quickly on him. Loudon now with a sense of urgency inside the traffic. Inside of Hunter, outside of Dalton. Superb move for your race leader to plant three lap cars between he and second place, Grant Anderson. And all of a sudden, he's got near on quarter of a lap advantage. How quickly the fortunes can change. Ludeman lost the handle in turn four. Big plume of smoke. Everyone motors through it safely. Reed now searching the outside. He's starting to close the gap on second place, Anderson. Eight laps remain for your leader. How will the race unfold? A massive advantage, quarter of a lap in fact, between first and second. Loud and smooth sailing out in front. Moving now upon Eddie Lumber to put him a lap down. Maybe the race for second with Anderson. Now as he sneaks by on Harley Bishop who looks like he lost a little fluid that time out of turn number four. Reed trying to search for a way by him. Van Bremen. A long way back now in fourth. What a clinic from your race leader Ian Loudon. Five to go. Milburn's working the high side as well. On Molino, Charles Hunter. They're having a tight battle. Still the same advantage of a quarter of a lap between first place and second. Ian Loudon maintains a handy advantage. Grant Anderson comfortable in second over Reed, who's likewise very comfortable over Van Bremen, who's fourth. Molino looks like he maintains fifth. Look to the lap counter. There's two laps remaining for your race leader, Ian Loudon. The Sydney Sider trying to run away with a cash here on opening night. Charles Hunter right ahead of him. Has a look to the outside. Gets by. White flag. One to go. Thunders down into turn three for the final time. Off turn four. Check it. Flag time. Ian Loudon. What a superb performance. Grant Anderson home in second. Matthew Reed in third. There's MVB in fourth. Fifth will be Darren Molino. Maybe Brett Milburn from Glenn Sutherland. Then your race leader, Charles Hunter. Well, viewers, that's some of the action here at Avalon. Maybe you should come down and have a look one Saturday night.